using. Hi friends, this is Miss Taiwan. Hi. Do you want to say it then? Hi, this is Miss Taiwan. And it's green means make you healthy. Yes, right, that's fun. All right, so we are going to make new ice cream today. So remember friends, last time we made ice cream using the homemade ice cream recipe, which basically consists of milk and vanilla extract and here it is and sugar but today we are going to come up with our own recipe and try to find out if our recipe is a good ice cream all right so my friends so instead of a milk I'm going to give Ben a choice Ben do you want to put milk in your ice cream or do you want to put a yogurt in your ice cream what do you want to put in your ice cream which one do you want to make this or this this ben chose one cup of yogurt so i'm going to draw that in my recipe so i'm looking at it and this is one cup so i'm going to draw one cup I don't know if you can see this, but one cup, so I'm going to draw one cup here of yogurt, yo, yo, yogurt. So I'm going to write yogurt here and I'm going to draw a picture of yogurt here. So that's my recipe here. So I have one cup yogurt here. So that's going to be my recipe and then so you're choosing one cup yogurt, and last time when we were making an ice cream, we used the vanilla extract. Do you want to use vanilla extract today, or do you want to use the, the honey that you are holding right now? Honey. Do you want to pour honey? Okay, so instead of a vanilla extract, he's going to add the honey. So last time we had, let's look at our recipe here again. Last time we had a one teaspoon of vanilla extract, but now we're going to write one teaspoon of honey. So I'm going to draw a baby, baby spoon of here and honey here. And I have to make sure that I draw the exact honey cup here, which kind of looks like a teddy bear. So that's my recipe here. One teaspoon of honey. All right. So now we have one cup of yogurt, one teaspoon of honey, and last time then we added sugar for the ice cream. Do you want to add sugar in your ice cream or do you want to add something else? You want to add? Okay, so now let's look at our recipe. Last time it was a two tablespoons of sugar, so I'm going to write two table spoons so i'm going to make sure that a, this spoon is a little bigger of sugar and my friends when you are actually making your recipe you can actually compare the sizes of the actual measuring spoons and you can decide which one that you want to do okay well Ben chose two tablespoons of sugar, but if you really like the sweet ice cream, maybe instead of two tablespoons, you can put three tablespoons, or instead of a honey, you can also put maple syrup or anything that you want, okay? But so far, this is what Ben came up with. One yogurt, one honey, and two tablespoons of, yogurt, of, of sugar. Is that anything that you want to add? So I was actually looking at the refrigerator and there are some things that maybe I thought it was interesting to add. So I'm going to show an example of it and let Ben choose, okay? So Ben, what do you think this is? Um, uh, I know. It's called the blueberries. Do you want to add your blueberries in your ice cream? Or I have um, something similar. Friends, what do you think this is? This is raspberry, and I also have Ben's favorite fruit. What is this called? Donkey. 
Yeah, this is called a strawberry. All right. So, do you want to put some fruits in your in your ice cream, or are you okay? Oh, you're okay. So, maybe, you know what? Ben decided that he doesn't want to put all the all the fruits inside. If you want to put some fruits in it, you can by chopping up into uh, or dicing them into a little pieces and put them in the ice cream. And I get, I'm going to ask Ben one more thing before we start making one. Ben, what is what is what, what am I holding? This is nuts. Do you want to put some nuts in your ice cream? No. No. Okay. So maybe Ben doesn't want to add anything, but he decided that he wants to add the yogurt and the honey and tables of sugar. So now, let's follow this recipe. Are you ready? taste it okay let me taste it how is it is it good I think it's really yummy okay so guess what we just made another ice cream and now this time we created our own recipe so friends why don't you make another version of your homemade ice cream and instead of using the recipe that Miss Haywan told you before, this one, why don't you create your own recipe and draw a picture just like Miss Haywan and share it with your grown ups and share it with your friends and encourage others to make ice cream. They're so good. Okay? Thank you for watching and bye.